SketchUp is great software if you want to visualize a product you've designed or create an in-store experience and you want to see how it looks, see what the flow through the building is like before you've actually spent any money. And this is a great thing, but we don't currently have any units dedicated to teaching it. So on YouTube here, with the um, course linked in the description, we've got a series of 22 videos which, which go through the very basics of SketchUp from very basic, let's um, look at the interface that's orbited around, let's zoom in and draw a square, right up to building some really complex items like a robot. So that's good and you can view all of these for free, share it with your friends and it's going to be there for free forever. But this is not the best learning experience. So to help you, what we've done is we've created a iTunes University course and I'm going to show you some of this and give you a look, quick look through over what the course contains and how you can use it to learn SketchUp for your purposes. This is my iPhone and if I open up the iTunes U app you can see my current courses. So to add the SketchUp course to your um, iTunes U, click on this plus icon at the top and you need to enter the code CZJRCC L Y C. That is C Z J R C C L Y C. I click OK and it will appear on your screen. Now, here we are. That's the intro to SketchUp CAD 3 CAD Levels 1 plus 2. It's by me, so when I click Agree, say that yes, I want to be part of this course. Now, top left of the icon was already there because I'd already enrolled, but I've just refreshed it. So let's go in and have a look and see what this has got. So we can start off with the info, and there's an overview of the course you can read. There's information about me, the instructor, a little email link, and an outline of the entire course. These aren't hot links, you can't do anything. So just go back to the info and now look at the posts. So the way this works is you've got your topics at the bottom, starting from Welcome to SketchUp, right through to Course Exam. So what you do is you go through each one of these individually. So I'm going to start with the second one, Intro to 3D SketchUp and we've got our skills and our challenge. Now you'll see in all of our sessions we start with skills and then go for challenges. We learn first and then we test. So let's just go start with number uh, first section, so CAD skills one. You'll see we've got four assignments there, so just click on this image and you'll see what we're doing. So the first lesson covers the basics of SketchUp to get you up and running in making your first item. And that first item is that little building there. You always get a picture of what we're going to build inside. Then we've got our, our assignments. Now these are four or five maybe simple videos that go through something in SketchUp. So have your phone beside you when you're at your computer working through SketchUp. Let's click on the first one and we'll see here Lesson 1, Interface, Orbit, Zoom, Pan, Draw, and Create Shapes. So I can click on the play button there, and that will take me through to um, watching a video, which I'm not going to go over right now, but that's where it is. There's also information there, and you can download it to your phone with a download icon. Right. Now, if there's something on here you don't understand, you can write it in a comment. So, sorry, I don't understand how to get started or whatever you got click send and that will appear on my inbox saying hey Chris there's a question here I can then respond to you directly so don't worry about the courses if you don't understand just re hit reply and I'll get back to you might even modify the video to update it so you just work through that after you've done each one click on the tick box to remind you that you've done it so you just work through that Again, you can put posts here, start discussion, there's lots of room there. Now once you've been through all those four, you go here to the CAD challenge, and this is um, something you've got to do to move on to the next section. Again, we're not marking you, we're just going and saying, here's things. So work through the assignment of the section to test your CAD skills. If you get stuck, just go back over the videos in the section to get instructions on how to do this. So it's not a test, it's just there it is. So we've got to make a simple house. Now if I click on that, you'll see a PDF of what we've got to do. So I say, in this lesson, you'll be creating a basic house in 3D. Try to create the house in the image as best as possible. The main building dimensions are provided in the bottom right. The other flourish is like the height of the building, height of the roof, steps and frieze should be done by eye, not the exact requirements. If you, the student, finish this in time, you should be encouraged to go as far as possible to make this house look real. So, freelance it a bit. 
So we make windows, doors, fences using existing skills. If I click on this again, you can see it's very simple. There's not much to it, but we can see um, three views of the house from the front and side. We got a 3D view just there, and we've got some dimensions, 10 meters, three meters, two meters, five meters. So this might not mean much to you right now, but after you work through the videos, you can. So that is about it. You go through your CAD skills, go through your challenges, move on to the next section. And finally, there's an exam, which means you create this absolutely fantastic church, which has been ruined and then made into a shop. Now, this might look a bit scary right now, but using all the skills in the video, it guides you through. And that is our item. You've got some notes here, so you've got course notes. You've also got um, some course materials. So if you want to see all the videos in one go, you can find them here. Um, Webly is a book there, which I recommend. SketchUp for Dummies, great book. If you want to buy it, that's a good price. Uh, and then any images, which I've got installed here. So you can view everything. Um, don't feel afraid for having discussion. There's one here, so any extra content requirements. So using this um, iTunes University course, you can really learn everything for using SketchUp that you would learn on a university degree for second year students.